of his next steps, move to the next class, take your pocket out of hand, and repeat these moves and moves to me. To me. Okay, hello YouTubers, hello everyone, it's Zisot96 here. Today I'm gonna show you my second video of the Gla Windows XP Golden Apps series. Uh, this video is the video of February. So, February's, February's Golden App is called Revo Uninstaller and as its name says it's an uninstaller tool but why would I want an uninstaller utility would someone ask everything in Windows is fine Windows has its own uninstaller no Windows, is Windows uninstaller isn't good you will see uh, in, a min in a minute why it's not good so the first uh, a first drawback of the windows uh, installer is that it's really slower than a revo uninstaller second secondly sometimes it doesn't delete all the files that were intended to be deleted and if you start messing up with games and uh, installing patches to games and all that stuff with the registry you see that it really helps you will understand me if you do that so let's move on let's open the program okay so this is the main window in this area it shows all your programs all your installed programs it's too easy to uninstall one. Let's say I wanna uninstall this program called Action Replay Code Manager. I click on it and hit uninstall. It asks you are you sure and blah blah blah. And here are four modes of uninstallation. The built-in run only the applications and installer without any additional scanning so it just takes the installer of the program located in the files for example I'll for example for the action replay code manager it's here action replay it takes this which says uninstall or something similar to this and just runs it the second is save anyway uh, moderate but I highly recommend using this advanced because it scans for registry leftover files and all of that stuff that uh, is the best uh, reason to make your computer slow and slow uh, while the time pass and anyway let's move I hit this next then it has four steps first it creates a system restore you see how uh, how well it prepares our uninstallation secondly it analyzes the applications data before uninstalling it starts the built-in uninstaller so when it is here in the third step the normal uninstall uninstaller appears uh, you hit yes okay what you would show if you did it manually okay then proceeds to the fourth after uh, e the fourth isn't really a step it's just to hit next this is the fourth anyway now it scans 
for registry and hard, hard drive leftover files, folders, registry items related to the uninstalled application. Please wait. Yeah. It's too easy, you see? You can see it yourself. Oof, I'm bored with boredom. <laughs> I don't like waiting. Anyway, I okay, it's done. Hit next, and here it shows what it found. Never mind if you don't know what this means. I recommend clicking to click select all and then delete uh, if you want to delete to uninstall an applications you don't want these files whatever they are so select all delete next you do this again there are some they're different the first window from the second delete again yes next and finish so you're done but it's not only the uninstallation tool. There are some other things you should really see. Uh, let's say that I have a program which does not appear for any reason. Let's say that I want a program that does not appear in this list to be uninstalled. There is the hunter mode. You just click it and Oops, oops, wait, okay, sorry, you see this thing, this icon, so you just drag it to the application you want to remove, so if I want to remove this one called HP Director, just hover it over the executable file, and this dialog, this bubble appears, it says it's it's info you just release the left click and hit un uninstall and some other some other options here but I don't want to uninstall it so cancel so this is the hunter mode except that this ah to exit sorry to exit hunter mode just double uh, right right click on this icon and hit exit now, uh, back to this application. Okay. Then there is a really good help file. You will see it. A refresh. It's so it does what it says. There is the view. Just click it and the view changes. There is a list to find it alphabetical, in alphabetical order. And if you click it again, uh, it has all the info, all the details of a program, comment, website, and all that stuff. And again, in alphabetical order. But I think the best is this it's more user friendly. There's the options tab, there are these languages, there are some options you will see you can explore it and then it's not only an uninstaller I didn't mention it in the beginning of this video it has some other tools so it's an auto run manager it has some windows tools here system restore security center system properties search folders disk defragmenter uh, on screen keyboard and the classical, the classic uninstaller of Windows. You see how long it takes, oops, sorry, to load. No, 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 sorry, this, this is not the uninstaller. It's add remove Windows components. It's a part, a section of the original uninstaller, just separately. Anyway, I'll close this. So this, 
then it is junk files cleaner if you have some junk files you clean it so that's pretty it the Revo uninstaller these are the credits blah 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 thank you for watching don't forget to comment rate and subscribe sorry for my English I'm not from England sorry again so bye